My name is Jara Stewart and I'm the owner and operator of Jara's Heavenly Sweet Bakery. We have been down in the Fifth Third Bank building on Summit Street for about three and a half years now. I have been baking since I was nine years old. My mom let me into the kitchen for the first time when I was nine years old and my mother had a passion for baking. Loved to scuttle around that kitchen and just make delicious things and my dad loved to eat sweets and that's what planted the seed of the passion of baking. And my kids grew up seeing me bake and I have one of my youngest daughter in fact works with me full time now. She's my primary decorator, cookie decorator and cake decorator and she's excellent at that and she does baking as well. Baking has always been something that it was my passion, something that I love to do. But I've had many other, several of the kind of careers. I taught school, high school for a while. I taught home ec. I, um, I was a news reporter at Channel 13 for years. But this has always been in the background. It's always something that I really wanted to do. And when my kids all grew up and moved out of the house, it, to me it was time for me to take that leap of faith and see if I could have a bona fide business. I, I had a home-based bakery for years and for many years, oh, probably about 20, 25 years, home-based bakery, and wanted to, I've always wanted a brick and mortar. I still want a place where people can come in and sit and eat and talk and laugh and sing songs. Sometimes we might dance. I, I want it to be like Grandma's Kitchen. That's what I'm looking for, and it's been a blast having even just this location. It's, it's just been a blast to have people enjoy something that I make with my hands. It's, it's been a real blessing. We're gonna be making a sugar cream pie, old-fashioned sugar cream pie. My understanding is that it's an old Amish recipe. One of my customers asked me you know, several months ago, do you make sugar cream pies? It's like, I don't know. I looked up a couple of recipes, found one, and um, it's a very simple pie to make, but very rich and very delicious, and I'm hoping that whoever purchases this pie is gonna love it. 